show you my breakfast today because I over poured the char seed pudding and now it looks more like a tadpole situation um, don't want to gross you out with that but I enjoy the taste and I think you probably noticed I curled my hair the weekend uh, I think you can see that I did not actually stop it because I'm working from home today so you're getting like a bunch of random curls and waves yes I'm gonna dive right straight into work so I'll catch up with you later Hey everyone, welcome to another chatty session of me and again I'm gonna do coffee making. I This time around I think I've put on my earpiece so hopefully you guys can actually hear me a lot more loud and clear I hope, fingers crossed. Yeah so um, I think as you can see I've already started drinking this um, this is from Hassel coffee so previously we tried like the light to medium rose and it comes with a more berry fruity note today I'm trying something that is a medium dark rose a lot more uh, rich dark chocolatey a lot more roasted nuts I'm usually not really a fan of uh, medium dark rose but this has really changed my perspective before I describe how it tastes like, maybe let me get my French press over here. And this time around, today I'm gonna do like a milk latte because I've just been craving milk. So, yeah. Yeah, this today is a Monday, and obviously I have very heavy Monday blues. Uh, it's so tiring seriously i don't know why i keep renting as well um okay so i'm gonna put like one tablespoon of coffee since i'm only making it for myself be right back with hot water back after putting some hot water putting a little less water since i've only put one tablespoon of the coffee grounds um i'm just gonna let it sit before i push all the way down so it looks like that and i set timer for about four minutes see you so waiting for my coffee grounds to seep in and really seep through all the uh, hot water maybe we can actually have like a mini chatty session and pardon me i didn't realize how <laughs> unruly my clothes would be because I didn't go for a tight curl actually, it's meant to be more, um, it's meant to look like a permanent blowout if you must say. Um, it's leaning more towards a more uh, volume, heavy volume kind of a hairstyle because I don't know if you could notice it well, previously my hair is pretty flat so I would like to have some volume in it and discovered that recently it's called like the capum. So, um, and I mean, yesterday we just came back from a JB trip as well over the weekend. So I was way too tired to even probably like um, dry my hair properly. That explains this unruly curls. But yes, maybe I should start doing like a weekend vlog um, just to show you uh, bits and pieces in terms of what I've been up to as well. So. This is my first time doing this chatty segment without endorsing any products. Let me know if you do enjoy such a conversation and let me know like what kind of pot topics you like me to actually share. 
I am back since my cup of coffee is ready. Um, yeah, gonna show you that I'm gonna press it all the way down. Brought my glass tumbler here, it's really cute. Really like it. So I'm just gonna pour over some coffee for you to see how the brew looks like. It's a lot more darker also because I put lesser amount of water. So this is how it looks like. And then over here is my favorite brand of nut milk. I'm using pistachio milk today. I feel like the flavorless over here is very impactful. I know a lot of people like oat milk, but being a health conscious girly here, I don't really enjoy the ingredient list that they put out. There's honestly so much different types of seed oil that they put and a lot of like additives. I just don't like it. So yeah, and I know <laughs> people usually either put ice or perfectly hot uh, steamed milk, but tell me it's a very weird girly. I just like it to be more warm kind of temperature. Not too hot, not too cold, no ice. That's how I've always ordered, even though even during my bubble tea orders as well. A taste test. Well, not really a taste test for me since I've drank it before already, but for the viewers here. Mm, yes, this is just the cup that I need today. Okay, I'm typically not the kind of person whereby I need caffeine to live by. I'm more of the type of person who is looking for good coffee beans to enjoy. And um, I was really very surprised about this brand because usually I wouldn't get past medium dark roast, man. It leaves a very acidic taste. Generally, yeah, I just don't like it and it's more bitter. This one is a lot more chocolatey which is why I like it. I enjoyed it so much. And even though it's a medium dark rose, um, there is a little bit of aftertaste. Um, but generally speaking, I enjoyed it. And look at this. It's so cute of a cup, right? So yeah.
，这是凹彩啊，对啊，没有我有。Why this kill? Where is all the Chinese? 